You should have two main takeaways in this video. These ranges have almost nothing in common. You should understand how you use the range in your particular cooking style before buying a French range. You see the difference between all three, their best features and a few problems. Also break down each and how to buy them because it is confusing. Stay to the end, I'll also compare the French ranges to an American Pro range. So by the end of this long video, you'll be able to decide which or even if a French range is right for you. La Cronue is a French range dating back to 1908. They pioneered the first convection oven. Their founder followed the new gas lines in Paris at the time. Before then, food was cooked over a flame. Most of the range is still built by 60 master craftsmen who spend generations building and refining their ranges. Recently, La Cronue was bought by Middleby of Ohio. Middleby has left La Cronue alone, keeping the heritage and craftsmanship. And it's still made in France. La Cronue's Cornufay line is French inspired in appearance, but is actually manufactured at Aga, an English factory. La Canche dates back to the 18th century. The original company was an ironworks known by the same family for almost 200 years. Like La Cronue, they're bought by a conglomerate, yet 10 years later, the company stopped manufacturing the ranges and idled the plant. However, a former worker saved the site and resurrected La Canche stove, still made in the heart of Burgundy, France. Nowadays, La Cronue is known by incorporating the best materials in its ranges. For example, the metal is sourced from Finland for its strength. Each unit is individually handmade and customized based on your specifications. You can design almost anything with Locker New with 56 colors and eight trims with the ability to customize. An unknown F1 driver wanted his range in a resin finish to match the car, for example. Most upscale ovens and brands are convection, but Locker New is unique. The air flows from the bottom under the oven, not from a fan in the back. Fans can dry the food. La Cronue has a patented concave arch top to provide a natural convection effect to cook evenly without drying your food. In larger sizes from 47 and a half inches, you can choose one gas oven and moisture heat for roasting and an electric oven for drier heat, which is better for baking. Then again, you can also choose both ovens to be electric or gas. For the smaller sizes of 34.4 inches wide and less, you can choose either electric or gas. La Cronue has cooking modes for every type of application from boiling to defrosting, including different types of convection specific to a type of cooking. You can see a description of each mode in our blog post. I'll leave a link below. You can really cook anything in this range precisely without guesswork. Unlike every other manufacturer, the range shop is fully customizable with every type of burner from electric to gas to pro-gas to naturally a French top for cooking many items at different temperatures. You can also choose a lava or rock grill, power burner, induction top, or a tapenaki griddle. When we teach classes in design, we always talk about how appliances fit in standard openings. It's true for almost every brand except for La Cronue. Dimensions are not exact to American cabinets. They're available in 29 and a half, 34.4, 47.2, 65 and 70 inches. And they're starting at 27,000 plus shipping. Cornufe has less options and sizes than the larger Chateau. You still have colors and a unique look for far less money. The La Cornu offers 12 colors and your choice of three trims. However, you can now customize the Cornufe in the 56 Chateau colors as a special order. There are only two sizes. The Cornier Fay 90 Albertine is 35.4 inches wide, starts at $8,400 in dual fuel versus $36,000 for the similar size Chateau. The Cornier Fay 110 is at 43 inches at $10,450 in dual fuel. Both Cornier Fays have the same top, either five gas burners or the 17,000 B2 max burner or five zone induction top. The 43 inch is a double oven. Whereas the 35.4 is single, 43 is an odd dimension, especially in the US. What people do is customize the kitchen around any odd size range. The conch is like a mix between Chateau and the Cornier Fay, offering more colors than the Cornier Fay and some top customization. The ovens, however, are different than either the Chateau or Cornier Fay. You have less modes, but more choices of specialized warming, vertical convection, and broiling ovens. Let's look at the largest, for example, the Sully 2200. You have two, the more traditional Classique or the more modern Mardern. 
In this 86 inch range, you choose whether you want a warming cupboard, gas oven, electric oven, without a boiler while the storage cupboard is standard. You have smaller and larger size ovens. On the top, you have three choices to customize your stovetop. The Lacanche is standard with two 15,000 BTU burners, two 11,000 BTU burners, and one 15,000 and one 5,000 simmer BTU burner on the other side. Then you have choices for three separate spots, similar to a La Crenoux with griddles, French tops, grill, and a multi-cooker. Most of the difference in smaller sizes, whether you want the oven on the left or the right, or whether you want a separate boiler, warmer, or storage. You have two choices for the cooktop burners or a French top with burners. The larger sizes, you can customize the top with more options, along with a larger oven and your choice of a gas or electric and more boiler, warmer, and vertical convection options. By the way, prices start at nine to 25,000. Shipping from France is extra for both La Conche and La Crenoux. Now let's compare each brand. La Crenoux is built to a higher standard using finished metal versus regular stainless via the two. It is noticeable when you look at the range and open the door. Chateaus are also equipped with solid brass burners for longevity versus brass and metal for the other two. It is manufactured to a higher standard more than any other appliance. However, 36,000 plus for a 36 inch, you should expect a much better product. You have two range tops, all gas with the center 17,000 BTU burner or all induction. The French plaque accessory covers the power burner if you want French top functionality. On the smaller models, until 36 inches, you only have six burners with the power burner at 15,000 BTU. With 39, you have two choices of a power burner of 18,000 or a French plaque. At 43, you have one optional choice along with the standard burners. Then you have two at the larger sizes. You can buy almost any combination from all induction, tapenaki, French top, burners, and power burners rated at 22,000. Cornier Fade, despite being French inspired while being built in an English factory, is American style electric convection only. 36 inch, La Conche has your choice of electric or gas ovens with a vertical electric convection oven on the side. La Conche features French convection, somewhat or American with air being circulated from the back. On the vertical ovens, you have to rotate your cookies according to users. You also have no broiling capacity in this size. Petite boilers start at their next size, the 39.5 inch. The Chateau is either electric or gas. The oven is concave with the air emanating from the bottom for natural convection. Natural convection, as we said, provides a steady flow of air and an even temperature beneath is the storage draw. Interestingly enough, you have an electric, not gas boiler included with either gas or electric ranges. In the Chateau, and a lesser extent the Cornifay, you have tons of specific modes for the most specialized cooking. For Le Conche, you have limited options. You buy vertical warming or low temperature ovens in larger sizes. You have that option in La simply by picking the mode. Their philosophies are different to delivery and installation in your home. One company, Art Culinaire, distributes La Conche, four showrooms, but limited local support for installation and service. La Canoe follows the traditional appliance dealer model. At first glance, dealers are a better strategy because you have someone to call to deliver, install, and fix a unique range. However, many dealers do not offer that level of support, so check first. What happens in delivery, installation, and service is as important as the purchase. You have customizations on the La Corneau and La Conge, but less so on a pro range. For example, Wolf and Blue Star will offer grill and griddle options at 36, as well as 48 and 60 inches with French tops. Some inductions available with burners for SKS, Fisher Pickle, and Thermal ranges. Without question, pro ranges have more output. Blue Star leads with multiple 25,000 BTU burners, but most will offer multiple burners over 18,000. With La Cornu and La Conche, you have an electric and gas oven for roasting and baking with two ovens if you want. You do not have that option in a traditional pro. It's either electric or gas. However, brands like Thermador and Meal offer steam and speed ovens instead of regular ovens in their larger 48 and 60 inch units. Also in gas, you have the most effective gas infrared broiler. The broilers are electric in French ranges. All American dual fuel ranges are self-cleaning and most now have decent smart functionality. While the French ranges are not self-cleaning and have no smart capability. Lastly, 
American Rangers are designed to fit standard cabinets, while the French are custom and should stand alone in custom cabinets. First, the different ranges and all are a welcome departure from stainless steel with rich color and trim options. La Canoe is the best in all aspects, from customization to materials to how it cooks with arch oven and natural convection, but is by far the most expensive. La Canche is a lower price consideration, especially in the larger units, where you'll save money. However, the ovens and performance are a bit different. I would check user views about their capabilities, especially boiling and convection in their vertical compartments. Cornifé is a lower price French inspired range, but is more Americanized with regular convection and standard ovens. You'll have the French look with ovens you're used to just with limited options and customizations. Before buying unique appliances like French ranges, ensure you have proper support and compare against an American Pro range, which may offer better features depending on how you cook. With an investment this substantial, you should look before you buy. So how'd I do? If I missed anything, you can leave it in the comments below. If you want to vent correctly, then watch this video. And thanks for watching.